to this vaccine. I'm Marcus. I'm Rose. Uh, and this is my Hero Academia Season 6 finale. Oh. So we just finished watching the Trigon finale, which will go up tomorrow. And today we have the end of my hero. Oh my goodness. It's, it's been quite a season. This has been a very good season. Very it's good. A very good season. Quite a roller coaster. Mm -hmm. It definitely brought things back up because I feel like a lot of people, I mean, I felt like it was getting a little slow since the last couple seasons. But a lot of people I feel like were brought back in with yeah. how to the points and then we're dealing with the main issue we've been foreshadowing for so long. Yes. Mm -hmm. Head on too. Yeah. Um, is there anything expecting for the final episode? Um, um hmm. expecting. I am expecting the the ball to get reset for us to feel like, ah yes, we have a bit of comfort and then we're like, okay, we gotta go. This is our, our game plan. Yeah, my I was gonna say my hero will clean himself up. I mean <laughs> Midoriya will get a chance to clean himself up, get a little rest, yeah. maybe, maybe not, because sleeping, I don't know how well he'll do that. But um, he's in a place where he can try. Mm -hmm. And I, I, I look forward to seeing him get a little bit of comfort before he, he go, gets all, I gotta go, again. Because yes. mm -hmm. he's definitely gonna get like that. And you're gonna have yeah. to fight him constantly. But with this uh, ending, I just wanna let you guys know that yes, we will be watching Demon Slayer, which is coming back next month, April 9th. And we will be watching just the Kaizen, but that's not for quite some time. It's gonna be July 6th. Yeah. That's the middle of the year, guys. <laughs> so this year is going by fast. But yeah, so uh, other than that, we have other shows going on. We have Hunter x Hunter. Hunter is also going to finish soon. We've got yeah. Finland's going on. Bill's going to be going for a while. Uh, yeah, check those out if you like us watching anime. And we'll probably put another anime in between uh, now and Jujutsu Kaisen just because there's enough time. Mm -hmm. But thank you very much for being here, guys. If you like your time here, please leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more. Remember, you can see the Patreon down below to see the uncut version of this or anything else that we do. Or see a week ahead for the shows that allow it. Thank you very much. We'll see you in discussion. Oh, come on, no. Oh. Uh. Stay. Of course. I guess a hero. He's like, I'm all night. Nice to meet you. Hmm. So he doesn't, he doesn't remember. Oh, no! <laughs> No. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my Oh. <laughs> I was wondering why it looked so pristine. Yeah. Imagine, the person gave me a pep talk right now and sting. <laughs> Look! Look at him! Look at him! Look at him! Look Stop the fire, all minds! Come back. Come back. Come back. Come back. That's all we needed to do. the <laughs> the <laughs> そのタルタロスでも。お、お。そして必ず。ヒーロー40名殺傷犯である。Hope is here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
at the party. The bath. <laughs> Quickly. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Security records. Ooh. on him or something. But they're running tests. <laughs> <laughs> he found a sword. sword. Yeah. Got out. Yeah. Oh, chief police. That guy. Well, not chief. 
深いやつらは電波でやり取りしていた電波の個性を所持していれば受信することも可能なはずだ、うん oh, 記録に残っていた電波の波形は会話のようだった、oh, 解析進んだんですよねやり取りの内容は三十八日で完成させる3 days? But eight days left. Oh no. Uh oh. 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 Three days. Three days. That's why. That's why. You win. Direct request. Tomorrow, he'd ask for help.、Mm, yeah. Paperwork. And is that a paperwork? True. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I think that was from a big red dot. Feels the same. <laughs> <laughs> Already、I、went? <laughs> Sweating in, in shadow. Oh. Star? Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> What the heck? <laughs> okay! It's <laughs> America's number one! Star is in stripes! Oh my gosh! Oh my god. Oh, of course. Of course. With a squadron? Oh my gosh. That's gonna be good. Alright, here we go. Oh, he's dreaming. <laughs> yeah, you can rest easy. <laughs> No, 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 Uh, there he goes. Discussion. Discussion! Ooh, so, good. oh my goodness. We start off with Sane、yes. and All Might. Yes. And still, Sane is like, how dare you dishonor the great hero?、Mm. He's like, I am the great hero. Why? No. You take that back right now. <laughs> yeah. Because of what, how he's behaving all like sad and forlorn and depressed.、Mm -hmm. And he's like, You're not All Might right now. Yeah, you're not allowed to be All Might. Yeah. But yeah. he is, the funny thing is, All Might says eventually, like, he didn't sense any intent to kill from、no. him. That's why he was so, like, just chill. chill. Yeah. I think Stain, he, he knew that was All Might. Yeah. He, he just wanted, he, he wanted, yeah, give him a pep talk.、Mm -hmm. Can you imagine getting a pep talk from a, a hero killer? Yeah. Kill. 40. 40 heroes. 40. That's so many people. Yeah. yeah, but those are just the ones he's killed. He's incapacitated a lot of them. Yeah, too. that too. Stain, he's very cool. He's very slick, very interesting, but he's a bad he's man. He's so、yes. terrible. He's a bad person, man. <laughs> I get where he's coming from, but that isn't. No. I mean, I, he has, he, like, I agree with him, he's right, but、uh, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> Stop it. Stop killing people. <laughs> Stop paralyzing people. <laughs> and then we see the last person All Might saved.、Mm -hmm. She's been protecting his statue.、Yeah. Every time they put up the sign, she cuts it off again.、Mm -hmm. and that's why he's a hero. He inspires hope and it comes back around and、yeah. she inspires him.、Mm -hmm. yeah. just by, and he also gets the flashback from Aizawa. It's like just by being there, you inspire people. Yes. Yeah. Yeah.、Mm -hmm. So even though he doesn't consider himself an active hero, he's got to keep up appearances because people are still looking to him for that inspiration. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So、uh, we also saw that Midoriya, they were finally just getting settled in. They're telling him, you know, he can sleep now. And they're just pretty much just gauging the situation.、Uh, it probably they were、um, going to do a, like a little band camp or whatever、yeah. for the people who are here to let him re be reassured. Yeah. The issue is that we have no time. No, not really. 
they literally have like way less time than so the information they were getting was all of like a cover information whereas the real information was being passed through the radio waves radio the waves. radio waves <laughs> the radio waves go to get information yeah where it was actually 38 days not two months mm-hmm. and uh, they have three days left now <laughs> yeah mm. that's very very important information because they would have been sneak attacked I and mean, yeah. not seen it coming yeah yeah and oh my goodness mm-hmm. like it's not like as if we don't have enough disadvantages as it is mm-hmm. yeah and of course, same before he leaves, he leaves some information mm-hmm. for all night. And only on one, even though there was three there. Oh, well, they, they explained what the rest was. Oh, I didn't. It was a love letter. No. <laughs> 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 you only gave them one, uh, I guess that's what a... Oh, the um, little th- SD card thing. looks yeah. like. He got, he, he took, inside the box it was three, three of them, mm-hmm. but he only gave them one. Mm-hmm. Why? Mm-hmm. Good question. It's possible that the others were just regular recordings of day-to-day radio transmissions mm. and that yeah. would pick something up right before the attack. Right. Uh-huh. Yeah, but, maybe. Uh, he could have just, like, condensed all of the useful information into one. That mm. too. Or just put it all know. onto a terabyte SD SD card right there. That's also possible. Mm-hmm. Um, it, I, I like the idea that that guy, like, at the last moment in his own way was a hero where he, he saw on the radio waves what was happening. It's like, what the hell is that? He downloaded it and even though everyone's getting shot up, he puts it in the box and he clinches onto it. Mm-hmm. Just like the little things that no one will ever see in the greater story yeah. that matter to you know? him. Yeah. Yeah. And Stane didn't kill him for that reason. He's mm-hmm. like, don't worry. I will pass it on to, to someone. someone just. Yeah. Many he understood why. died to bring us this information. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And speaking of dying, uh, Stane just occasionally mercs a villain where he sees, oh, oh, yeah. Oh, here like... we have our bad guy die. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you, you're bad guy, you die too. Yeah. yeah. Just moves on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I want I just want to like him but I really shouldn't oh no because he's like just him. bad yeah he's bad but I like him yeah yeah I, li- I like him he's a very interesting character mm. but I also believe he should be executed yes yes, yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah so I, I like his phrase like I'm a beast on the side of the world yeah <laughs> he's just doing what he does yes. oh, yeah yeah Exactly. He's doing what many, many would like to do. Like, it's... Because it's a contradictory place to stand. Yeah. You know? And you kind of have to come to terms with that and not let battle with that daily. And he's he's fought that battle and ended it. Mm-hmm. Where he's like, nope, this is me. Mm-hmm. I, I want this and I'm going to do it this way. <laughs> yeah. I'm curious what set him on that path. Mm-hmm. Like, what event mm-hmm. made him change? Yeah, mm-hmm. I feel like we might get something on it because mm-hmm. so. it's him and All Might right now, mm-hmm. his best buddy. Yeah. yeah, he wants him to end him at the end of it. I'm yeah. wondering what, if that'll actually happen. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. That's his one request. Yeah. And he gave him like D Day information. Yeah. Like, he needs to know this. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I think maybe <clears throat> All Might, who is aware that he has to be the one to kill him, yeah. um, he might give him the other two discs thingies mm-hmm. at that point when he's like, he does what he asks him to do. Mm-hmm. Or maybe a uh, un reverse card happens and he recognizes Midoriya as also a true hero. Because he only, him. he only wants to be defeated by a true hero. Yeah. And the, to him, the only true hero is All Might. Mm-hmm. So maybe once he sees it in Midoriya, he's like, you know what? You can end me too. Yeah. <laughs> Would he do it? Would he do it? Midoriya probably wouldn't do it. No. Probably wouldn't want to. Yeah. yeah I think he would, would accidentally do it. Like, he would try to like stop him from doing something and strike him, and then it was unfortunately fatal. I don't think that. I think it wouldn't work. No. <laughs> but um, I also liked how they were talking about. Um, I know it's towards the end, but when they brought up the whole "we're bringing in heroes to help," I had also been thinking, what if we get to see villains who are like seeing what All for One's doing, and they come to his aid, or old friends come to his aid from outside the country? It'd just be mm-hmm. interesting to see like foreigns, uh, foreigners from both sides starting mm-hmm. to fight, and seeing maybe crime syndicate leaders who mm-hmm. are not quite on the level of All for One, but super powerful here fighting. Yeah. Just have like a massive battle. Yeah. So and it seems like that is going on. They yeah. said that in their countries, unrest is happening almost as if he had people ready. Which, yeah. No, so, so Strip said he has he people, had people ready. ready. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So. Yeah. It's and every, it's happening everywhere at the same time. It's like they coordinated. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. And of course, America couldn't stop America from coming to, <laughs> to aid. Yeah, She's literally things. America. <laughs> this is the guy America. sweating in the in the. It's like our hero already went. <laughs> we what? couldn't stop her. <laughs> <laughs> remember we talked I don't remember where we talked about this if it was a podcast or maybe my hero 
of how no it was a podcast because we were excited to see how we went to see what the rest of the world was doing with quirks mm -hmm. and we're like we, maybe it would just be like the japan's version of the rest of the world right. and like <laughs> how they always make americans out to be these loud boisterous people and here we have yes. like, america just like the most <laughs> jacked woman i've ever seen jacked out of her mind <laughs> Her blonder than the sun. Yeah. <laughs> all of the flag all over her. Yeah, yeah. Stars. Her name is Star and Stripes. Star you know what? I love stripes. it. It's very out with it. Yeah. 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 Oh, they're flying over there. They're just standing on the drum. Standing on the drum. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> I see where all my gets in. You know, you, know you can come inside, right? Yeah, like, you're just flying over if they can fly? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I wonder what her power is going to be. Yeah. Me too. Mm. And, I want, and I think it, it blah, blah, blah. Um, All Might is good friends with a lot of these heroes yeah. from the mm. other countries yeah. and I wonder like what her story is I think we'll find out like why she is like as soon as All Might calls she's going mm -hmm. like because I know he, he, he's elected by a lot of people but yeah. that's a lot of loyalty there mm -hmm. yeah. leave your well, own country he is the number one hero in the world oh. and he did he also trained in, in, or, America. in America true mm -hmm. that's where he got his his start before he went, came back to Japan mm. a lot of time to build his bones mm -hmm. so I'm guessing they, just over time they just had a lot of respect for him and they liked him as a person and she doesn't look like she's too much older than him mm -hmm. true agreed mm -hmm. um, then we also see we flash back to our our friends our class A and Deku trying to take a bath, a very aggressive bath. Yeah. Like, quickly strip him, spray him down, <laughs> throw him, dunk him, whatever. Submerge. <laughs> like, it was like, use industrial steel wool. <laughs> it's like, bro. It's dirty the bath. <laughs> well, I mean, you know what? I, 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 kind, I kind of agree. Kind of agree. But they he's, sprayed, he's that, was, dirty boy. that was some hard spraying of water, though. Like, they were running around naked boys <laughs> around in circles, spraying him down. So I, I have faith that that process worked. You need to use a power washer. <laughs> Yeah. And but, then Midori's just there. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, their faces after they all got in, just like little, weird, weird, little weird, smiles. This weird smiles. I'm like, oh my yeah. gosh. <laughs> and then um, later he asks about Uraraka, where she is. She is passed out because she has done her job. Yeah, she was yeah. emotionally like, drained. Emotionally done. All of the girls, they said, were like, well, she was the only one fast asleep. Everybody else was awake. <laughs> it's just so they didn't talk to each other. Yeah. Not right now. They, they need to have a they moment. They can't have the conversation yet. Yeah. The ship cannot sail yet. <laughs> we have another season to go. A couple more at least. Next season. We're calling it next season. It, it sails. <laughs> I, I want it to sail in a way that it's like they're, they're definitely a thing, but they never say it. Yeah. I think that's likely. Yeah. 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 This doesn't seem like the type of show that would delve into it too much. Mm -hmm. Like the kind of with Earjack and. Yeah, I was going to point Kirish that out. Kirish yeah. Kir Kir Kirishima? Kirishima. Is it Kirishima? Yeah, sure. Why not? No, no come, 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 um, I wanted to point out during um, All Might and Stain's conversation, Stain had mentioned like if a god falls into um, onto Earth and become and is give, like basically given mortal form, and then All Might was like, well, "How do you know? know? Yeah, what, what was, was that about? Name? Yeah, and then he was like, "I don't know you," and then we changed subject, kind of, sort of going forward after that. So I was like, what, what, I don't understand anything he just said and that is supposed to be significant. Uh, I didn't think it was significant at all. He was like, how did you, yeah. It's like, how did you? Know? Like, you know, the thing they say when somebody says information that means they know yeah. things. Mm -hmm. So. Does, does that mean that the first, the first superhero um, was, th that happened? Mm -hmm. He gave, he was a God given mortal form. Mm -hmm. I kind of don't want it to go that mm -hmm. route. Yeah, so uh, apparently the camera had cut out earlier and we didn't notice, so we're going to have just... Well, you're going to have to just have seen that it was audio till now, but we'll just continue. Mm. Um, yeah, uh, what were you talking about? Uh, God, baby, twerk, quirk, mutant, happen. Mm. Yeah, it's so out there, I, I feel like that can't be it. Yeah. <laughs> I think it was just trying to be a metaphor, mm. but it maybe the metaphor 
maybe it is the metaphor that we're we're reading into it. We're reading into it too literally. Like it's mm. just a metaphor, mm. but it, it's something along those lines. You know, maybe I don't know. Maybe the first person, I don't know. Maybe the first person was genetically made or something like that. No, yeah, that does remind me. Um, someone in the comments when we we're having that discussion over um, if the quirk changes the person just as much as the person can change the quirk, maybe mm-hmm. like they morph the quirk. Yeah. Uh, someone said the original name for quirks was supposed to be individuality, so it seems oh. it could be that. Oh, oh, that would make sense. You're hmm. smart. Cool. Um, I just want to s- call the first episode of season seven. What's it? Musical. Oh yeah. I wouldn't mind that. Yeah, as a start of a season, much better than mm-hmm. trying to end such a like a heavy season with a yeah. musical. Yeah. I was not. I was like, please don't do it. Please don't do it. Please don't do it. <laughs> yeah. I was already. Yes, it's a happier time. They're in a more peaceful time. I don't need to see it. Just, yeah. just tell me you had a musical. Yeah. I don't need to see it. Yeah, but yeah, that would be the uh, nice way to just kind of start off with a bang again. Hopefully mm-hmm. not. I, I, honestly, the last musical one was a little slow for me. So I hope this one was a little faster, mm-hmm. a little more excitement. Last time when it happened, uh, it really took me out of it. Because yeah. I, at that point in time, we were already going through a slower season. Mm-hmm. And I was just like, okay, that's nice. Okay, can we get back to it? Yeah. So I was like, Same. no, we we'll just come back to it. Don't bring us back. Please. Yes, yes. Which is why I was kind of a little worried when we saw Class A. Mm-hmm. Not because I don't like them. I genuinely like them. But I feel like the tone shifts when you've got a whole class of young kids. Mm-hmm. So they have to have, I don't know, it's... More, it brings it more grounded. Yeah. yeah. I agree. More youthful. Like, closer to Kitty. Yeah. Kid, yeah. Kid that's true. Think. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It feels like you're, you're going back to domestic life. You're not living yeah. as a hero yeah. anymore. Mm-hmm. Action-packed. Yeah. I, I, I don't like seeing Midoriya suffer, but through seeing him go off on Solo, we saw some of the best episodes. Yeah. yeah this is true. This is true. Um, I was just going to say, Midoriya has nightmare. Still slept well. Mm-hmm. Slept till morning, but yes. he wakes up from his little nightmare. Yes of the words that are still haunting him and he still has to find a way to deal with it mentally and emotionally. Mm-hmm. Of but he's next. Now they're doing it together. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And he's at least considering that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Honestly, sleeping till morning, probably not enough. You know when people stay up for like three days, don't they sleep for two days straight? That's true. Like that? I feel like he should just spend as yeah. much time as possible sleeping. Yes. Mm-hmm. I, I have had moments where I'm sleep, like I'm sleeping and then in the morning I start to wake up, but it's like I'm I'm in a like a half in between sleep mm-hmm. and wake mm-hmm. and I just keep drifting back asleep and awake and then drift back asleep yeah. Yeah. and I can do that for hours yeah. no I love it it's great I hate it I love it I hate it I love it because it feels like I never get fully rested yeah. oh no but I can f- full sleep I feel like I've slept but then it's like I'm just comfortable in that place and I'm just I'm like in between and I want to stay there and just like just exist you know nah man <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, so I mean, overall, um, this might be my favorite season. First, my hero. Yeah. Mm. And I know it could be, it could be seen as shallow, just like you just want action, but it wasn't just action. We got a lot of reveals. We mm-hmm. got to see co- who Compress was. He got to have a moment. Everybody got to have a moment. Mm-hmm. Pass got to have a moment. Um, seeing all the plans come to fruition, all for one, actually showing why he's so scary. In season two, when we saw him blow up like a small section of the city mm-hmm. with like an air blast and nearly kill Best Genius, we we're like, "Wow, this guy's scary!" And the music introductions like this is, "Wow, this anime is really going places." Mm-hmm. And then, I want to say like four or five, at the later part of three, we we're just kind of drifting through training and training and term and arc and term yeah. and arc, and this brought it back to this is why this show was so amazing. Yeah. Very scary people, very real stakes. The what's his name, Giga Mac. Mekia guy, he ran through 20 cities, dude. Yes. Like, Gentle Mekia. Yeah, Gentle. that's what makes this show really impressive. Mm-hmm. I agree, it was a great season. I, I really fun. enjoyed it, and it, it you, you were on your edge of your seat the whole time. Like, mm-hmm. up to the last episode, they still gave us, like, don't rest, guys. Yeah. There's, mm-hmm. there's no rest for us. <sighs> we still have a lot to do. Mm-hmm. So, and it, it's it set up the stakes even higher than before. Like, we always knew we had to deal with All for One, but he, he felt, like, out there. Mm-hmm. And then when, even when we faced him, we put him away in prison. Yeah. You know? So it felt like we're safe a little bit, even mm-hmm. though you didn't know. You know you weren't safe, but you kind yeah. of were sold this scene. Like, oh, we're safe, mm-hmm. we're safe. Which I think was part of the telling of the story of the how this is how people think. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They feel safe when they're not yeah. really, and they're they're living a lie of what a hero is. Yeah. Yeah. So all of that was broken this episode. Everybody's glass house was broken, mm-hmm. and we're literally in shambles. And it, it's kind of fun. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's kind of fun. It's kind of fun. Yeah, I totally yeah. agree. Uh-huh. Yeah, and you, you see little bright spots where you see how, despite the city destroyed, no one dared to actually 
break all my statue. No. Everything's destroyed around it. They just put a sign on it. Yeah, Yeah, but you don't break that thing. You don't break Mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Yeah. So, I mean, uh, for season seven, do you think that might be the final season? (sighs) If it's 24 episodes. If it's 24 episodes. I feel like yes. I feel like it, yeah. I I feel like it, yeah. I I don't know how it would do another 24 episode season. Because it's always been 24 episodes, right? Every season? I believe so. Because think of the ground we covered in this one. We had the first 12 episodes was an entire battle with Shigaraki. Mm -hmm. And we lost several people. People died. And then the second half was dealing with an entire arc. With the Lady Nagant and Mm -hmm. the Soul Deku arc. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess next season they could like totally slow it down again. Slow it down and just be dealing with all of the like people All Might has sent out. All the jailbreakers. And getting introduced to other country's heroes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the, I yeah, I was gonna say I kind of feel like they could drag it out quite a bit, but I I just wonder if they will learn from the success of this season that they shouldn't. <laughs> um, I don't know. I will suspend my vote, but I, I I'm leaning toward no. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I didn't consider the whole all the heroes had to be introduced and we had to have like maybe arcs again to know them. Yeah. So like that could take easily twelve episodes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And also the musical could take easily ten. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I feel Hopefully I feel not. like since they've already done it once, they're gonna they'll tone it down. What is the concise concise size consolidate mm-hmm. that whole process thing? Yeah. I agree. Yeah, and I, I at this point now I'm hoping for a massive battle, not just between Midoriya and Oshigaraki, mm-hmm. but be- between. All the heroes and all, all the, villains, the villains because they've said in every country they've got people ready. Yes. Like this is a world revolution. Yes. That's going on. But yeah. I'm yeah. Looking, looking forward. Yes. Mm-hmm. So guys, thank you guys very much for being here with us through this entire season. It was a great season and we're looking forward to the next one. It's gonna be a couple of years, I guess, probably. <laughs> but you know how it is with anime. Um, but next month, April 9th, I think I said it before, uh, Demon Slayer will be coming back and we will be watching it. It seems like it might be a Sunday show mm. and we will be watching it on the day of. Yeah. So thank you guys very much for being here. Guys, if you like your time here, please leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more. And comment down below what you thought of the season, yeah. what you thought of this episode, and if there's anything that you were hoping they'd get into or things that they didn't get into that you're surprised by. So thank you very much. We'll see you in the city. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, bye. I just thanks to our patrons, Tyler Costin. Alex, Mario Charles, and Jesse Gallimore.